Japan-Caribbean Climate Change Partnership, we call it JCCCP, is a regional project. This project, JCCCP, aims to support countries in advancing the process of inclusive low emission, climate resilient development by improving energy security and integrating medium to long-term planning for adaptation to climate change. In 2016, with the support of the Ministry of Agriculture, we decided to develop a project proposal to support the activities of not only Vinsafe, but other small producers crossing Vincent. First of all, I would say it's a novel project. Because people would ask, what preschoolers have to do with agriculture? That's the first thing, you know, you'd ask. You can take your children outside so that at least they would learn, as I said, learn about the ground and the earth and how you can grow your own food. If even it's to make a, to grow a head of lettuce in a pot. So we help our children to be industrious. Uh, very happy to be here at Randy Lewis's farm to have a look at what he's doing. I mean, as you can see, it's uh, uh, quite a slope here that people farm on in St. Vincent. Uh, and we're looking at ways that we can improve uh, his farming and the farming of others through various uh, climate smart agriculture uh, ideas uh, that are being supported by the Japan Caribbean Climate Change Project. Japan Caribbean Climate Change Partnership one that he's given to me, it will benefit, benefit me so much in this job. Help me um, to continue with my planting of my vegetables. We're here at the Langley Park Irrigation Scheme. In 2013, there was a storm event that caused some of the damage is that we've seen in the background and destroyed some of the main irrigation pipelines that rendered the irrigation scheme not operational. And so we proposed under the JCCP project to rehabilitate these irrigation schemes. Once we get the water into the system here, there are existing pipes just behind us and the irrigation system feeds 141 farmers over 250 acres and we hope to benefit, those farmers will benefit from the, the repair works being done. As you can see now, what you see are really remnants of banana farms that were once flourishing and productive fields. You now have a few patches of bananas and plantings here. You see a lot of abundant lands. You see a lot of um, decline agricultural systems. And that is as a result of the loss of the irrigation as a major key factor in the production system. This is just the beginning of our activities. We hope that we could share more news which will be obtained during the implementation of this project and share the good practices and lessons learned which will be specific to the local condition in the St. Vincent and the Grenadines.